about dragonflies, the thing that strikes me the first is that they are all very beautiful. Um, different species come in different color, different patterns, and they are such um, amazing animals uh, because they can fly very well. They are one of the best uh, flying insects in the world. For this particular damselfly that I discovered in the forest, the Rebecca Sprite, so when I first saw this, um, I knew that it could be something either new or rare. And when I managed to catch it and examine it properly, um, it turns out to be a new record. So this is very good for Singapore. This particular damselfly um, is blue in color, especially the mature male. So the front part of the body is bluish and at the tip of the abdomen is also a bluish spot. So when you are in the forest and in the stream, because it's all green with trees and you see one bluish damselfly flying around, then who knows, it might be a replica sprite. Dragonflies, because everybody knows that um, they inhabit streams and ponds and the larvae of dragonflies, they actually require good uh, unpolluted water to actually survive. So when you see, when you're at a stream or a pond and you see a lot of dragonflies flying around and breeding inside, then you know that the water in the stream and the pond is not polluted, um, it's clean. Clean of course doesn't mean the water must be clear, crystal clear like that water, but clean as in like there's no pollutants in there. So um, once you see this happening, because the dragonflies are flying around, it, it indicates that the water body there is uh, unpolluted and the water ecosystem, the freshwater ecosystem is, is uh, very healthy. So when you go to a pond in a park, do not uh, litter into the water, into the pond, um, do not un release your un unwanted fishes or, or terrapins into the pond because all these are not native animals to Singapore so they will be harmful to the freshwater ecosystem.